I would hope that these debates do not become personal in nature. They should be held only to the substance of these pieces of legislation. Uh, that's the reason I rise, Mr. Speaker. I don't like to hear that. There should be civility and professionalism only. And we don't need to take personal issues out with one another. And I want all the cameras. We have cameras. Go ahead, watch this, okay? What we find is there's a lot of issues coming up in newspapers saying how they're underperforming or their expulsion rate is high, their suspension rate is high. They're starting to become a segregation of children between the haves and the have-nots. The, listen to me, minorities. I'm over here because we're all over on this side, right? What you'll also find, wait, we have, we have a half. We have a half. But right now, as it looks- Excuse me, excuse me. Members, members in the chamber, can we have some order, please? That's fine, Respect they've been the disrespectful, so and, and bring okay. the noise level down. Representative Rebelletti, for what reason do you seek recognition? Mr. Speaker, I cannot believe what a distinguished lady from Aurora just did. And I have a profound amount of respect for her. But when you turn and only look at the Democratic side of the aisle and say, oh, minorities only, I guess we don't have any minorities on my side of the aisle. But what I will also say is that when I represent 108,000 people, it's a very diverse group. It's not one monolith not one particular demographic or background. It's 108,000 people of all different backgrounds. So I don't think that's very fair, Representative, what you did. That's terrible. Speaker, I, and I know that you're trying to keep as much order here as possible. I don't believe that was professional or civil. And I'm extremely disappointed in that type of reaction. Representative Chapalavia, for what reason do you seek recognition? Point of personal privilege. Please state your point. I apologize. But the, the frustrating thing is that we're here for children, not, not an association, not a hidden agenda, what have you. We're here for the children of the state of Illinois. And what's frustrating is you have outside powers putting things into people's heads that aren't 100% true. So that's what the frustrating thing is. I apologize if I offended anybody over there. I apologize from the bottom of my heart. You know I'm not that type of person.